Hi guys, um, I'm a bit late with this. Um, let's see, I'm very high there. I'm a bit late with this glossy box review. Um, it was actually the February one, but it, came, it, came, it comes like the month before. Oh wait, it works. So it came in like January, um, and it was the actual Valentine's glossy box, um, and it came in a pink, bright pink box this time. Really nice bright pink box there. And we've got a little card. Happy Valentine's Day from Glossy Box. I know I'm really behind. I'm sorry. I was meant to do it near a Valentine's Day, but just had so much on. Um, and in this Glossy Box this time, I'll run through the things that I got. A few of the things are really good. Got the Ico Skinny Eyeliner. And that one there. And this is in powder pink. It's a bit of an unusual colour, really. I probably wouldn't buy this in the shop, I just wouldn't even pick up a dusky pink eyeliner, I just think what's the point, but it's really really good, it's dead creamy, really really cream, creamy consistency, it's lovely, and I've been using it in like the corner of my eyes, um, some people use like a white eyeliner and it helps to brighten your eyes, open it and widen your eyes with a little bit of white in the corner or on your... Um, what it's called, you know, on the line inside your eye there. Um, a lot of people do that with white eyeliner, and this is not as harsh, but it open. I think anyway, it opens. I've actually got a little bit on at the moment in the corner. I don't know whether you can see because it it's blended in with my eyeliner, my black eyeliner. I just think it just gives you that little bit of um, widening of your eye, I suppose. Yeah, so it just tells you what. I suppose what to do with it, it emphasises your eyes but yeah it's lovely, I like it, it's a nice creamy consistency and it's really posh I like the end of it and it, sa it says on the packet as you use it and sharpen it you'll never lose this little bit of handle on it you know, sometimes you end up with an eyeliner about that big, that big, that big because you sharpen it, sharpen it but with that it's actually the full size of an eyeliner but you've always got this handle at the end so I thought that's quite cool so it's quite posh, posh packaging, quite nice eyeliner package there because you usually just pick an eyeliner up in the shop and that's it. Okay, the next thing I've got is Davine's Moisturising Balm. This is fabulous. Oh, let me just go back to the Ico, sorry. That was £9.50 for a full size, which that one is there. Okay. They have a deal on at the moment. Enter Glossy in the comments box to get a free gift with any purchase uh, for Ico. It expires on the 1st of March, so that's quite a good thing. So actually, yeah, it's £9.54 price. Okay, back to the Dav Dav Davines Moisturising Balm. It's the authentic result of our commitment. It's a pre precious line of intelligent products rich in natural ingredients. This is fab. It's so nice. I will say I've not used it on my face. You can actually use it on everything. I've not used it on my face because I'm, I've got quite sensitive skin. I have to use, I just stick with what I know really with my face. Now and again I'll try something but with the moisturising thing I've not really, I don't really overly use anything else than what I already use which is just a cheap moisturiser. Um, so this is for face, hair and body balm and for, for your face, it's a cleanser really for your face. I don't really cleanse, I don't do that kind of cleansing routine. The you know eye makeup remover and then your makeup remover and that, I, I don't do all that. I just wash my face at the end of the night and that's it and the same in the morning. I just use as I probably said in my previous videos, tea tree facial wash, that's what agrees with me and that's what I use and it's cheap. So. Um, but yeah, this is you can use this to cleanse your face and it's great for the ends of your hair. I have been using it on the ends of my hair, I've tried to use it on the ends of my hair. It's very good, very conditioning, so that's really nice. It's quite on the expensive side, £17.40 for full size, which obviously that is. Um, but it's, it is a lovely moisturising, use it on your body, but it says to put it on your body and rinse off. I've just been putting it on my legs and leaving it really, using it as a, um, a moisturising balm rather than washing it off because I think that's just a bit of a waste. But yeah, um, yeah, I like it. It's good. It, like I say, it's just a bit on the pricey side really. We've got, um, what make is this? This is Davines again. This is a cleansing nectar. Basically a hair and body shower gel kind of thing. It is very, very nice. It's quite thick and gloopy, it's lovely, so it's in a kind of little travel bottle as well. That's full size 1850 and that's definitely not full size, that, that's just obviously kind of like um, a travel size I suppose. Then we've got 
the Fab Gentle Body Wash. So I've got a lot of body things this this time in this um, February Valentine's box. The Gentle Body Wash cleanse, calm, redness and relieves dry skin, safe for sensitive skin, that's really good and it's quite cute again because it's in a little bottle so I've got, it's great when I go away because I've got all these handy little bottles to take with me, I have used that, I've only used it once and it, it was just a shower gel really but obviously it's good for sensitive skin, it says gentle body wash, cleansing cream, free of common irritants such as lanolin, alcohol and phthalates I think it says so yeah so obviously if you've got ultra sensitive skin on your body, body that's obviously dermatologic, dermatologic, dermatologic tested so obviously that's quite can't even speak so that's quite obviously good for people with sensitive skin um, all over your body so full size is £13 so I think I mean I don't know what, what the full size is they do it really oddly 226.8 grams whatever that means, I only do mil really, I mean that's that's 56.7 grams so if we think 226 grams it's going to be full time bigger than that isn't it, so I think 60, 13 pound, I mean if you've got ultra sensitive skin on your body and you can only use something in particular it's quite good I suppose, that's that one and last but not least we've got Murad um, skin, skin Perfecting Primer, I've used this a couple of times under my makeup, I haven't put it on today, I completely forgot and it's basically a primer for under your makeup use every day after moisturising, blend evenly over face and neck wear in place foundation or under a foundation to keep your makeup on and for a fresh look so obviously this is just my little trial size one which is handy again pop that in my handbag um, and this says dewy finish, I don't know whether it has a certain colour on it it's not, it's like that colour so I have used it myself and it's been fine but I have put it under my own my own foundation so I haven't just worn it on it on its own. I suppose that would be quite nice in the spring you don't want to really pass loads of foundation you just want to put a little bit of something just to highlight your face so yeah so that's that. So yeah so it was quite quite cute really a lot of things for the body, body washes and things like that in this February glossy box but yeah quite chuffed with that one. So yeah, so I'm quite pleased with that and I have got another glossy box so I will be doing that for you um, in a couple of days. Um, but yeah, so that's the February glossy box so I hope it's helped everybody, I don't know if everybody's going to go out and buy the things but you know, obviously this will pop up with certain things that you know you want to know about kind of thing so I've talked about them. Um, yeah, so that's it really. Okay, so that's my February glossy box and I'll be back with my next one in a couple of days. Alright, thanks guys, I'll see you soon. Bye!